So y'all, my little ghetto fabulous twin sister, Cardi B, you know she's born October 11th on my birthday, and her cheating husbands are in the you in the streets fighting. You know, this is why. This is why I'm against young people getting married. You're not ready. As I was going to do, I did an interview. Um, well, I'm just going to wait. I just want to wait before I let it out on y'all. But I did an interview on um, on Sunday, and I said I was going to do a video correcting what I said about young people getting married. When I say young people, I mean two 21-year-olds. Or two 25 year olds. And you know how I feel. I always feel the men should be older, mature, established, gone through his phase, get control of the D. You don't you don't want your husband to be married, girl. <laughs> Trying to get control of the D, okay? So if she's 25 and he's 30, to me, that's different. If they're both 21, no. Okay, so I'm, I'm going to do a short, um, uh, because women are more mature than men. So if you're 21 and he's 21, you're 21's girl, but he's really 14. Okay. So this is why another reason I am so against young people getting married. But anyways, child, she Cardi B knew who she was marrying, child. She knew who she was married. Uh, anyway, it's a happy Tuesday, rainy Tuesday here in the Northeast, honey. I am loving it. Every, all my other friends and everybody, oh my God, the rain, it's been raining for a week. I'm so sad and I'm like, I'm so happy. Rain, 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 rain. Come, 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 come. Because if it rains, it's not hot and I hate the heat. But anyways, I want to thank you for your love and support. Uh, the shout out to all of our new remnant cousins. I absolutely adore you. I thank you and I appreciate you subscribing. Thank you for checking out my thumbs. The Bachelorette came on last night. Did you watch? Did you watch? Did you watch? I'm going to be watching and talking about it so we can get um, charity some more views because I checked the groups. Girl, not a word. Okay. I'm in all the Bachelor, bachelor and Bachelorette's group. They ain't talk. Some of these groups that was always on fire. But all the other bachelors and bachelorettes ain't said not one word about the black girl. So we have to keep it going and, you know, try to do as many videos as we can so she can get some a lot of views for her for her season. So be sure to check that out. Okay, y'all. Who child. Well, honey, Tasha K. Excuse me. And again, I just want to thank you for those of you checking out my books and who have signed up for the Husband Profile course. Begins July 8th. If you go on my website, you sign up. You, you, If you did not get a prompt to pay, you did not sign up for the Husband Profile course. You can't just join on my platform as in you join the email. Doesn't mean you signed up. If you didn't get a prompt to pay, if you didn't pay, you didn't sign up, okay? Because I had a couple of people saying, oh, I signed up and I didn't get enough. I said, did you pay? No. Then you didn't sign up. Okay. So thank you. And of course, 23 times of guys, you mind me. I absolutely adore you. So honey, Tasha K, we can always count on Tasha K. Release uh, the cheating that uh, Offset was cheating again on the wife. Had the had the side chick in the house. In the, in the bedroom, I would have to, so let me tell you the blood, the blood. Then he going to come out and say, my wife effed in, on me, gang. Y'all know how I come. So this is after Tasha Gay said, according to her, she has known all since 2013 up until last year. And this is at their home in Vineland in Hollywood. She says that's her daughter bed. And she's sitting on and in the camera. She's with Sugar Knight. Sugar Knight, no. So according to Tasha Gay, the side trick says she was in Offset House and uh, uh, was in the marriage bed, child, not the marriage bed. You're going to bring a woman in my marriage bed. Woo, child, but that's because, you know, when you marry men, that's going to bring the husband, the side chick in the marriage bed. So I don't know what to tell you. But anyways, let's go on over to uh, TMZ. Shout out to TMZ. I haven't read anything from TMZ. TMZ, she said, Cardi B lashes out at Offset after he says 
she cheated. Cardi B is publicly ripping off set a new one after the Mike Michaels rapper announced to the world Cardi B allegedly cheated in the past. So he cheated. And according to him, she's she cheated back and now he's mad about it. So I don't understand why you're mad about it. But anyways, you know, I try not to get into married people business. But anyways, if you missed the post and delete from Offset Monday, he wrote, my effing, my wife F-A-N on me, gang. Y'all know how I come. Mm -mm. Clearly, peeved by his post, Cardi B lashed out on Twitter spaces only hours later, denying the claims and said even if she wanted to cheat on Offset, it's the next to impossible because she's just too famous. I can't play the video, girl. Every other word is an F word. She even went as far as to say she'd smack Offset upside the head with a bottle if he had the claims to her face, if he had made the claims to her face. Cardi B referred to Offset as the countryman to her followers and even alluded to him suffering from some sort of downward spiral. Wow. What's not clear is where Cardi B and Offset marriage currently stand, but things don't seem great. Mm, Cardi was conspicuously absent from Offset's side at the BET Awards last night, which was an emotional gut wrencher after he publicly reconciled with Quavo to pay tribute to their late bandmate takeoff. Mm, mm, mm. As for fans, they're largely on Cardi B's side. Offset infidelities have their own storyline at this point, and many people think the only thing he deserves is a tiny violet. Ah! <laughs> tiny violet. Um, so, you know, what do y'all say about this? You know how I feel, cheaters cheat, and, you know, these people in Hollywood, child, it's just, it's successful to me. But it's not the first time he's been accused of cheating. She keep giving him a chance. And, you know, she's saying, I should have cheated. I should have cheated. If I give this P to anybody else. Anyways, I couldn't have, I couldn't, I just, there's no way. But anyways, let me know uh, what y'all have to say about it. And I did, I know a couple of you emailed me about Tasha, uh, Cardi B said about Tasha K, that when she gets done with her, her kids are not, she, her, she can't afford to send her kids to college. I mean, if they get scholarship, they can go to college. And if Tasha K ain't got no money, I mean, girl, you she could just move up to here. The county college is free based on your income. But I'm sure there's, a, you know. But anyways, I love Tasha K and Cardi B's my little sister since she was born October 11. And, you know, she just is crazy. She's just so emotional. But I love her. I love Cardi B. And I love Tasha K. But anyways, let me know what you think about all this foolishness. I absolutely love you and adore you. Yes, y'all been emailing me about the book. The book is coming very soon. I will keep you posted on that. All right. Love you. Talk to you later. Bye.